Hello everyone, my name is Andre Dima, I'm a professional travel photographer and video maker and today we are going to talk about why are Fujifilm cameras becoming so popular. First of all, the look of the camera. Even if you are not into photography, you cannot deny that Fujifilm cameras look so good. From the rangefinder models like the X-E4, X-100V and X-Pro3 to the retro looking models like the X-T5 and even the more modern cameras like the X-H2S. If you look closely at the X-H2S, you will find that it has some subtle but beautiful design features that other modern cameras do not. If you want to see more Fujifilm content, subscribe and check out my videos about the X-T5, X-H2S, X-T4 and much more. Some people come to Fuji from film cameras because of film simulations and controls. While this is not the same experience as shooting film, it is a very good compromise because film is getting harder and harder to get because of its increasing price, but more on this later. I think the most popular cameras from Fuji are the rangefinder style cameras. The X100V has exploded in sales since most influencers use it. So did the best alternative to that camera, the X-E4. So is this just a trend created by influencers or Fujifilm cameras have more to offer than just looks? Yes, they do, and the next great thing about Fujifilm cameras are the dials. They don't just make the camera look good, they are actually good for beginner photographers to learn the basics. They also improve the experience of taking photos, making you think more about photography and less about specs. It's such a joy to use a camera like this. Every time I go out, I always tend to grab a Fujifilm camera and not another, just because of the experience it gives me. Another reason is the image quality. Fujifilm are well known for their color science and of course film simulations. Every camera comes with these film simulations Fuji has created from their long experience with film. These film simulations give you some beautiful results and they are not just for JPEGs. If you shoot RAW, you can add them over your RAW files in post with software like Capture One. And that is not all. Remember when I said Fuji cameras are a great compromise for people that shoot film? Well, you can create your own film simulations. And there are tons of recipes that try to replicate film like Portra 400 and much more created by other people. There are a lot of film recipe communities where we can find recipes or add your own. This has become a hobby itself. APS-C sensors have come a long way, especially when it comes to dynamic range. This comparison here is just to show you how much APS-C has evolved when it comes to dynamic range. It is so close to full frame cameras. Yes, it is not going to get better than full frame. And yes, full frame is better in low light. But you need to ask yourself the question, do you really need full frame? I rarely take photos above ISO 1600 with Fuji Fast Primes. And Fujifilm sensors perform very well even above that. The noise from Fujifilm cameras just looks pleasing to the eye. It's not a digital mess like on other cameras. Another thing is size. Some APS-C cameras are smaller than full frame and Fujifilm has a great selection of quality small lenses that can create a great light setup for any type of photography from travel to street and much more. Yes, you can find small full frame cameras and small lenses, but the price is going to be higher for something that you may not need. You need to keep in mind that photography is not about pixel peeping, it is about composition, light and how it makes you feel. If you have enough experience, you can take great photos with a 10 year old digital camera. How do Fujifilm cameras differ from other cameras on the market? 
Fujifilm cameras offer a distinctive experience that creates positive emotions, creative inspiration and an unmatched sense of satisfaction that encourages you to create and capture moments in a way that other camera cannot replicate. But wait, there's more. Video. Fujifilm cameras are getting more and more popular for video because of their specs and wonderful color science. Also, autofocus is getting better and better. The X-H2S with firmware 3.0 is as good as the competition. I used it for paid projects and never felt the need for full frame or got disappointed by the autofocus. It can shoot 6K open gate in ProRes HQ, 4K 60 with no crop and 4K 120. The X-H2 can also shoot 8K, the X-T5 can shoot 6K, 4K HQ, 4K 60. All new Fuji cameras can shoot in 10-bit 422. They all have amazing log profiles that can give you great dynamic range. You get the point. They are also very good in low light if you pair them with the right lens. And I'm going to say this again, the noise is nice on Fuji cameras and can be easily removed in post leaving you with great results. So from my point of view these are the reasons Fujifilm cameras are becoming more popular. Yes, the hype helped, but there is more than that to Fujifilm cameras. If this video was helpful, subscribe, like and use the links in the description to support the channel. See you next time.